it's important to recognize that the U.S. Preventive Services Task Force um, is trying to identify um, a surveillance strategy um, that will optimize the benefits and minimize the harm to patients. Um, that we shouldn't use this uh, set of guidelines as a source for concern, but, um, but rather a point of discussion uh, with physicians uh, to determine who is most appropriate uh, to undergo mammograms. And there should be a more judicious use of uh, screening mammography for patients uh, under age 50 and over age 74. By adopting a strategy such as uh, what's proposed by these guidelines now, um, we might in essence be permitting the diagnosis of cancers of the breast at a later stage. And while that might not necessarily um, adversely impact mortality rates, that could have implications in terms of the need for more aggressive treatment measures. Uh, to address later stage disease, and, um, and that could in turn increase uh, morbidity for patients and could have uh, an impact on um, increased cost to society. And, and those parameters were not at all addressed. The treatment is um, without question more aggressive uh, because the risk of disease recurrence is greater. Um, and uh, so the approach to surgery is uh, potentially more aggressive. The approach to medical management and, and radiation needs to be um, accordingly um, uh, uh, addressed. And, uh, and again, that, that can have implications as far as uh, quality of life. Um, more aggressive treatments uh, tend to uh, um, be more uh, stressful for patients to go through. Um, nevertheless, if the goal is cure, uh, people are willing to go through these, um, but, they, but they certainly have implications. It is um, um, far less uh, stressful physically, emotionally, um, to go through uh, treatment for earlier stage disease um, in general than, um, than more advanced disease. Maintain a good relationship with your physician. Um, have uh, discussions on a regular basis about screening, not just mammography, but colonoscopy and, and uh, other evaluations uh, to uh, reduce risk of uh, or, or to optimize early detection.